Welcome back to my channel guys. In this video I'm going to show you how to do the ALET and how to learn it. In the background you can see me doing some, some ALETs and so on on Stronghold. Yeah, and if you want to learn how to do those as well, stick by and I'm gonna show you how. Um, I wanna apologize first for not uploading for a very long time, but I just didn't find any time and motivation to make video videos, but now I'm back, so if you enjoy, comment and like if you want. Thank you, and now to the video. Okay, so what's the basic idea of an ALED? The basic idea is that you th throw someone through the freeze and unfreeze him after the freeze. What does that mean? Um, you can see my dummy is standing exactly one block right of me. So there's one block in between, this one here. But even though he's not directly standing next to me, I can still hit him. You can see now I can't, but I can hit him like this when he's standing directly next to me. But it also works if he stands one block far, like that. And that's how you can ail it. Now, most of the time, you won't ail it through where there is no freeze on the ground. Like right here, it doesn't make sense because there's also no freeze here. But you get the idea. Now, what do we want to do if there is freeze on the ground? Like on Stronghold, for example, I would say it's a pretty good map to learn ail it because directly at the start here. Um, there is an ALED right there. So I can stand on the ground, but I somehow have to hammer my dummy through the freeze. And the best way to do so is like this. Fucked up. But you get the idea. Um, the movement is very precise. So you won't get it on your first tries, but that's no problem. Because I'm going to show you now um, how to learn the movement. So just go to the start, turn deep fly off, and always do this movement. You jump over your dummy, and when your dummy is exactly right next to you, You double jump and hook him to the other side. Like that. And keep repeating this until you, you're super confident that you can do this movement whilst leaving. Okay? Like that. Now, if you can do this, the only thing you have to do now is to hammer your dummy when it's right next to you after you have swung it below. That's what you do all the time and that's how you, how you learn the ALED. Now, if you feel confident, you can go to over to the real ALED so that you can see if you really unfreeze your dummy. Now, if there's freeze on the ground, you of course cannot jump off the ground. So, what you're gonna do is you're gonna start the movement you just learned just after you got hammered. So, I get hammered and I do the movement I just learned. Now I failed it, that's no problem. And yeah, as you just saw, the basic ALED works like that. I'm gonna show you some slow motions of me doing the ALED now. Uh, 
I'll do the second A-let. The second A-let works like this. You throw your dummy above your head. And then when he's right next to you, you hammer him. So throw DJ hammer. Throw DJ hammer. Throw DJ hammer. And you have to train this again like the last A-let on the ground. And if you feel confident, you can just go to into the map and try the alert yourself. This alert is way harder though, so shouldn't be frustrated if you can't get it in the first tries. And um, since I don't want to do it right now, I'm going to show you a slow motion of me doing the alert. Okay now, so to the last alert I'm going to show you and the basic movement is like this. You swing your dummy one time around you and hit him right next to you like always. This is ex especially useful if the dummy is laying too far into the freeze so you can just do the standard alert. Because for the standard alert you have to be above him, and for this alert you can actually be next to him. So hook him around you and hammer him into the correct direction. Then he will be unfreeze. Be aware that you pro most of the time will hammer him very high into the sky because of the way you throw him. And slow motion. Video over, bye bye.